Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, my name is Matt. Uh, the channel here, of course, is eBay Pice Man. So I mostly make sourcing videos. I go to places like Ross, Marshalls, Burlington, uh, Play-Dohs, Uptown, thrift stores, and try to look for shoes and clothing to resell online. So today, uh, we're gonna be hitting some Rosses and gonna try to hit some Burlington's and hopefully, can never get these intros right. Hopefully, we will find some good things. I've been uh, checking on Instagram and people's been finding some crazy stuff out there at Ross. So I hope that's the case for me today. I appreciate everybody coming in and watching. I hope you do enjoy this video. Hey, remember, if you like it, hit that thumbs up button. I appreciate it. If you hadn't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Drop me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. And wish me some luck and we will catch you in just a minute all right everybody so let's start off at ross today we got these nike dragonflies uh these are a great shoe to pick up if you find the right size these were a big size it'll probably take a little bit longer to sell but at 20 dollars with the spikes and bag we're not going to leave those behind got a few questionable pickups in today's video guys some of these nike super reps uh, these were usually like 40 bucks or 19 so I'm going to try a couple pairs. But more than likely, these shoes are going to be some bricks. Uh, so it might be uh, something I dump or just return later. And yes, I am wearing some red Crocs with jeans. So next we're at the Burlington. We got some of these Adidas uh, cycling shoes. Um, these wasn't good at all. They were selling really cheap on eBay, but hey, you never know. They could work if you want to pick them up and try them. 30 bucks on those, but I did end up passing myself on those. And it has some of these crazy looking uh, New Balance moccasins. This is a weird type of shoe. 20 bucks, so not bad, but uh, I just didn't think they would sell good. But like I say, hey, you never know till you try. So I did find uh, there this uh, Nike Trek uh, singlet. Uh, the Bowman one or Bowerman, however you want to say it. And it was only like $13. Retail was $90. I think it'll probably bring an uh, easy $50 or $60. So I'm glad I found that one. And uh, so here at Ross, we got these uh, pretty cool vans right here. The Jason Friday 13th. I'm pretty sure you've probably seen in other people's videos uh, them finding them. They are pretty cool shoes. They glow in the dark. $33 on those. I do think they'll make some money. And... Uh, I know you've probably seen these in Hustler Hacks last video. The Nike Alpha uh, Menace 3 Elite. 18 bucks on these. Get all these you can. Hustler Hacks found like 17 I already sold one of mine for $150 plus shipping. So was super happy to find those. I really didn't source that much this week, but I'm going to get out. I mean last week, but I'm going to get out a lot this week and source. So I got these Nike uh, jacket hoodies. Uh, these are the Digi Camo ones. Pretty cool. Uh, retail $140 on these. Uh, Ross price, uh, $30. Bucks. So I picked up two of those just to test out. Uh, hopefully they'll bring $75 or more. Who knows? Uh, it's really not the type of weather to be selling those. But sometimes you just get in a Ross frenzy. And it's been a while since we've seen anything out there. Got these Nike Air Force One Sage. $50. Bucks. I just sold a pair of these. Uh, a couple of days ago for a little over $100 on Macari. So I'm going to pick them up. And we got some of these Nike Up Tempos, Pippins, uh, GS models. And these, I would be, my dog's barking over here if you hear him. So I would pick these up definitely if they are a good size. Uh, but those were kind of small size. And I know probably some of you have seen these uh, Nike Rat Golf. I was super shocked on these, uh, the resale on them. Uh, the people really tank the prices, or maybe it's just the colorway that people don't like these. I don't know. $25. I picked up two pair. Going to test them out and see how it goes. And we're here at Burdington. This is going to be the last stop of the day. Uh, they got some of these, uh, what are these, Phantom GT Academies. 50 bucks on these. Uh, way overpriced, but it is good to see some Nikes at Burlington. And it has some of these Adidas Stan Smith. These were kind of like made with recycling stuff. They did have a stain on the front. These almost feel like wax. They're definitely a weird looking and feeling shoe. Uh, 30 bucks, on, no, 40 bucks on those, but I did see some solds on these, but I did pass because of that place on the front. And right before I left, I ended up finding uh, this Nike track, uh, Singlet Kenya. 
20 bucks on this, probably 50 or 60 bucks. So I appreciate everybody watching the video. Stay tuned. I'm sure we're going to be finding a lot more stuff out here at these stores. I appreciate everybody watching today. Take care. God bless. And we will catch you on the next video.